Hi guys, Pete Turner here and welcome to the second episode in this vlog series. So if you watched the first episode, you'll know I were in St. Vincent. I expressed a sentiment in that episode that suggested that you guys should try to, no matter what happens in life, whatever obstacles life presents, surpass those obstacles to live your dreams. And it really got me thinking when I got back, there's something that's been on my bucket list for a long time that I've put off. I've always wanted to be able to capture a photograph or a video of the night sky. I've always wanted to see those lovely blues and purples and the shooting stars shooting across the sky. And I've got the equipment, I had all the gear and no idea and I just on a whim decided right it's time I stopped procrastinating. We jumped into the car and we set off on this journey towards Scotland. On Google after running a quick search it suggested it was the darkest place in the United Kingdom and I decided I'm going to capture the elusive beast. So I travelled up there, set up, saw some amazing things and this is what Scotland looked like. So this episode is going to be a very short episode because this episode is essentially about putting the feelers out for what you guys would like to see in the vlog series. This is as much about you guys as it is about me. So one piece of advice I can give you on being creative in order to be able to open the space in your mind to get the best performance out of yourself, whether it's, you know, if you're an actor, if you're a singer, a script writer, if choreography is your thing, illustration, drawing, cinematography, is to have your own space. That's really, really important. So just find a place in your house, in your room, wherever, that you dedicate solely to whatever it is that you're doing. Just get yourself a little desk, put a chair at the desk, just put something to the side. And what happens is after a bit, your brain gets accustomed to leaving behind all the problems that you've got in your actual world and as soon as you step into this little space all your problems and, and stresses disappear for a few seconds you don't have to worry about the requirements that society sets in order for you to be creative you see that's the big problem is when people are trying to be the most creative they often find that they've just had a fallout with a girlfriend they've just you know had an argument with a friend your parents have had a go at you works not being the way that you wanted it to be and all this affects your creativity. All of this stuff puts a hurdle in your way when it comes to being the most creative that you can be. And by having this little space, this little place, that your brain becomes accustomed to locking everything else out, you'll ultimately maximize your own creativity. I'm lucky enough to have a barn at the back of my house that's been converted where I put a, a little studio in there and a little office set up so that I can get out of the way when I'm creating, when I'm writing. I have a nice chair to sit down in there and just reflect upon things. And ultimately I've been a million times more creative because I'm escaping from all the stresses and all the problems that surround me on a daily basis. So here's a little look at my space. So the last thing that I want to talk about today is you guys, because you guys are essentially the vehicle in which controls the content of this vlog series. This is a message to the viewers that are watching right now. What would you want to see from my vlog? Whatever you say, I'll try to make happen as long as the requests are not so ridiculous. So please subscribe to my channel, click like on this video and drop me a comment. The more comments that appear in the box, the more things and episodes that I can create in my own mind. And if there's anything that you want me to talk about, if there's anything that you want me to go into depth about, this would be the place Place to do it. This would be the place to communicate with me. This is the best place to contact me because email, my emails are stacked. My Facebook is constantly stacked with messages. Instagram, which I don't really use. This is a clean open source in which you have a forum to express your opinions. So thank you for watching this vlog and I really hope you loved it. Until next time, take care.